just got teleported to hell. What's up, lads? My name is Ragnarok, and welcome to my show. Today, we will be continuing Little Misfortune. But before we do that, I would just like to say 99% of you guys are not subscribed. And if you would do that, that would help me out a lot. So, without any further ado, let's get into it. I was trying to use my mouse, and I'm almost certain this game doesn't use mouse and keyboard. <laughs> well, I mean, it uses keyboard. I have to I'd choose that in the beginning. Ooh. Go up the grave. That was such a short trip to need music for. a portal. <laughs> be Welcome aware. To my game. I'll be your host and humble narrator. You remind me of game. The rules of this game are simple. Play it until the end, and you'll be rewarded. All right. I won't do that today. I mean, I'll have to break it up into like 30-minute episodes, but I'll try. And <laughs> this is Miss Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you, and a little bit. Hey, do you know how hard that'll be to clean up? <laughs> the sad part is, today is the day she will die. Huh? Huh. I can hear you, you know. Oh? You can? Mm-hmm. Are you inside my head or something? Hmm. Well, okay. Yes. <laughs> All right, I'll call you Mr. Roy. What did you say about me dying today? Die? No. Nobody said anything about anyone dying today. Huh? <laughs> Nobody said nothing? You know, I have prepared a game for you. A game? Really? For me? If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. A.K.A. Death. Eternal happiness? I guess I could give that to my mommy. Okay, it's a deal. Oh. Wonderful. Fan Dimensions just broke. Ready to play? Yes. Your first mission is to leave the house. Okay. Jump out the window. Uh, I was pressing buttons. They got this character. Benjamin. Look, I drew this picture. It's the fox I see outside my window sometimes. I call him Benjamin. He's a really cute fox. Ugh, I don't care much for foxes. Well, aren't, aren't you rude? Fox I, see. I call him. He's a really cute fox. Ugh, I don't care much for foxes. Well. Look, this is my secret hiding spot. Oh, it's quite cluttered. Impressive. But why do you need a hiding spot? I don't like it when mommy and daddy argue too much. And when I come here, I can dream and travel far away. I see. That's <laughs> kind of sad. This is Babsy, the guardian of the secret spot. You see his eye? He got that from a battle against a monster. 
A monster? That sounds scary. It was. Ninja. This is my diary. Nobody saw my jewel. I'm so cute. <laughs> Did you hm. draw all this? Uh-huh. Oh, all right. Um, <laughs> the peak of love, that's what it is. Oh. I don't like it when daddy hits mommy. Oh, I didn't think we'd go into that much that's detail. Uh, my Japanese friend, he's a ghost. Glitter, I love my glitter. <laughs> I peed in the lake, it was really warm. Look at that picture. I was such a baby. Very cute. Now I'm such a lady. I'm a little lady. That's what I am. I love my flowing bo- Oh, no. Game. I don't like choices. I'll take it with me. I'm gonna take it with me if I get bored, okay? All right, I'll set, set this place out the window. I like to move my body. <laughs> it's the music that. Uh, if this music's copyrighted, I I, I don't claim it. Ho hold on, no, <laughs> it might be. Ah. Uh... Ah. Uh... It could easily be copyrighted. Before you leave, which talk can they take them? No, you can own and remember your choice is much more important than you think. Okay, I choose unicorn or stone. Hey, the stone will be a lot more useful. You can chuck it at someone's head. The stone daddy threw at me once. Oh, interesting choice. It's already been used. Yeah, I call him Stony. Because he's a stone, get it? <laughs> Stony the stone. That's very clever. Thank you. Oh. Lovely. Uh, and so you know, I like to sprinkle sparkle on things. Shabam! <laughs> Happiness to everything! Hey, you. On the other side of the screen. Yeah, what? I told you she was going to die today. Yeah, that's happening. That's a secret between us. She can't hear me. I'm good. No, the box is outside. Oh, wait, did I accidentally just go back inside of her room? I did. Throw it at the grandma. This is grandma. She was. You still wear a diaper? Nah. That was so last year. It's all broken now. <laughs> was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Please don't tell on me. Don't worry. You can trust me. Okay, thank you. Hmm, maybe I could. We'll fix it. I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. Okay. Well, this. This, my friend. This. Grab it. This goes here. I think. Um kind of obvious that this goes here. Um, oh, this, this one right here, it can go here. Ooh. Mm. <laughs> that goes there. 
this goes here. Uh, this one goes here. This goes here, huh? Ah, oh, I got it. Did. Oh wow, such a beautiful vase. My daddy's friend was a hunter and killed this moose. His daughter Erica, she thought his gun was a toy. She said bang bang to her mommy and daddy. Then her parents died. <laughs> and she was so sad. <laughs> uh, I kind of like this game now. <laughs> cigarettes in here yeah that's my mommy she also likes to drink juice a lot <laughs> well are you ready to complete your first mission yes throw I glitter am. at her i'm gonna get that prize it's in the fridge oh dead uh, rabbits again when will daddy learn i like them alive Oh. <laughs> when I grow up, I want to be just like my mommy, a juice drinker. N no, you don't. Trust me on that one, child. Oh no. Then go quiet, okay? <laughs> Good day, morning. It's afternoon, Miss Fortune. Ah, uh, okay. Good afternoon, morning. <laughs> Remember Benjamin the Fox? This is where I first saw him. He was hiding in the trash and we made eye contact. It was really intense. Yes, you told me about that fox already. You shouldn't trust the fox. They're all criminals. Well, that's just speciesist. Criminal? <laughs> that's silly. This pool smells like a toilet <laughs> because I pee on it. <laughs> <laughs> that is disgusting. Not as disgusting as when my daddy puked in it. That was disgusting. <laughs> Agreed. We can take the car. This is where daddy often sleeps. Hello, kitty. Here, come, come, kitty. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Oh no, is it gonna? Kitty, don't go. Oh. Damn it! I never get to pet the sweet animals. So. Before we continue, you need to know the rules of the game, Miss Fortune. All right. All right. Remember, you will be given choices on your journey. Okay, choices. There is no right or wrong, only consequences. Okay, okay, only consequences. All right. When you beat the game, the prize of eternal happiness is yours. Okay, death. Your next mission is to cross this road. I can do that. Look to the left. Look to the right. Any course? No. Okay, I'm going. She got teleported to hell. <gasps> I saw a monster. What monster? I didn't see anything. It was there. I saw it. It's probably just your imagination. Yeah, that's true. I have a very big one. Just keep going. We'll have so much fun. All right. <laughs> a dead bird. Look, a sleepy bird. Come on, Miss Fortune. Let's go now. Aw. 
Jesus. Lovely. Jeez. Everything wants to kill her. Well, thank you, game. <laughs> I thought game was gonna talk. Look, there's a puppy. Hello, puppy. What a cute party hat. Now focus, Miss Fortune. You have to make a very difficult choice regarding this puppy now. Be aware. It looks of happy. Consequences. All right. Do not maul me. So we can share a nice time together. Good choice. Now throw the ball at it. What ball? This ball. Ah, that ball. Okay. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Puppy. Oh. What did I do? It's all broken now. Mr. Boys, everything I touch breaks. What's wrong with What's that ball made of? Nothing wrong with it. Sometimes life is just unfair. But I'm here for you. Really? Thank you. Well, sadly, the puppy will miss the party now. What party? The owner of this dog, George, is having a party. I think you have to go and tell him about the accident. What accident? Ah, uh, yes, the puppy, yes. <laughs> what accident? That didn't happen. A bit farther ahead. All right. I don't want to step in the poop. It says no dogs allowed. Oh, really? Oh no, I step on doggy do. <laughs> Understandable. Wait, throw glitter at it. Glitter and is is that why it's pooping? <laughs> I can't watch. All right, I killed a dog, guys. <laughs> so, Miss Fortune, at the other side of this lake, you will be one step closer to the prize of eternal happiness. And that pony, right? Ah, yes. That too. You know, once at this lake, I got my head stuck in a plastic bag. I remember falling asleep and waking up in the hospital. <laughs> That's terrible. Yeah, I almost died. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Most effective way of kidnapping, and she seems oh, fine with it. Happening? I think you're in big trouble, Miss Fortune. Yeah, tell me about it. Where are these birds taking me? I have no idea, but you have to do something about it fast. All right. Kick them in the balls. Well, I know that birds don't have balls. Okay, my glitter is uh, unless they do. At the door, they will only see shiny, and they will get confused and leave me alone. 
That sounds like a solid plan, Miss Fortune. All right, here I go. Where's Hurl Park? You don't see it. You don't really seem to be into it. This has taken a long time. We didn't even go that high up. Well, time seems to slow down when we are in danger. Am I in danger? Oh, thank you, bird. Hey, look, a bird. Hello, bird. Oh, that was a rude bird. <laughs> Why didn't I break my legs in that? Mm, you seem very good at falling. Thank you. <laughs> Unless it was the narrator. So, Mr. Voice, is the party on the same way to the eternal happiness? Yes. Yes, it is. Oh, that's convenient. Have you thought about how to break the news to George? About the puppy? Yes. I mean, if you want to. Oh yeah, we did kill the dog. Yes, of course. That's the least I can do for the sweet puppy. That is very brave of you, Miss Fortune. Thank you. Why is he so far away from his dog? Oh, look! A boat! Hello! Are we there yet? Just a little bit farther away. Ah, okay. Ah, uh, oh, a fish. What should we do about Very it? Very tired fish. Bring it with us. I'll keep it. His uh. name is Rodrigo, and he needs a new place to stay. I like Rodrigo. I wonder if Rodrigo <laughs> has heard about sushi. <laughs> it's like Rodrigo put in tiny pieces, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Don't think we should mention that the Rodrigo. Hold on just a second. Now we got time. And here we are, the house of George. I'm a bit nervous about introducing myself. You'll do fine. Hi, I killed your dog. Bye. <clears throat> about the puppy. <laughs> Stop it. I'm doing it for the puppy, you know. <coughs> Hey, look, a dead fish. I got a doorbell, so we ring the doorbell. Nobody's answer. I'll invite myself in. No misfortune. Time to check out the party. I saw a man once floating in the lake, just like this fishy. Are you sure this is the right house? Where is the party? Hello? Oh! Excuse me, are you George? Are you the owner of a puppy? Because I bring really bad news. Oh no, wait. It looks like he hung himself. Hung himself? Like a piñata? Should I hit him like a piñata? No, Miss Fortune. He's dead. Hit him like a piano. Piano. <laughs> Piata. Oh, crap. Piñata. Yeah, he's dead. Oh, okay. Hey, Miss Fortune, I think this party's over. Let's leave. I'll meet you in the back. George, you know, now that you're dead, your puppy is gone. I like the puppy. Bye. Oh wait, I can glitter George. Happiness to George the Piñata. <laughs> wow. Okay, I'm here now. Let's go into the woods and get that eternal happiness. Yes. I have a feeling that it's gonna be like a plot twist and instead of the fox being evil, it's gonna be the voice. Since he did say that she was gonna die today. Oh. The trees and the birds and the animals. Dangerous animals, Miss Fortune. 
you might run into a fox. A fox? Like Benjamin? Yes, but all foxes are evil, so keep your eyes open. Uh, all oh. right. Huh. What's this? Voodoo doll. Everything began with the song of a jackdaw. <laughs> All right. Everything began. Oh, I did not All mean right. to click on that. Hmm. Interesting. Hey, what do you have there? Nothing. Oh, even she's not trusting the voice. Stay back, Miss Fortune. Wild, dangerous fox. Why? I recognize that black tail. It's Benjamin. It doesn't matter. Attack it before it kills you. No, I don't think Benjamin will kill me. <laughs> Hello, is your name Benjamin? Do you want to play with me? Oh no, don't go! Oh. <sighs> what a relief. We are safe now. Let's keep playing my game. Okay. There's a magical cave nearby. You need to find it. A magical cave? Okay. <laughs> oh, it looks, it looks pretty cool. I like fighting a fox. <laughs> Focus, Miss Fortune. We need to keep going. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, <laughs> being followed by something. Oh, yay. Place where a dead person's died. But sadly, I'm going to have to end this video here. So, goodbye. If I can save this can. I can. Goodbye. What's up, lads? My name is Ragnarok, and it seems you reached the end of my show. If you liked it, you can subscribe, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. Bye.